All right, here's a different angle that we have today. Okay, so I don't have my headphones in, so hopefully, hopefully you can hear me, but I thought I would do a quick reading. Okay. Sprays the Sudge, Sudge, <laughs> Sage spray. Oh my gosh, it's getting low. Okay, so first off, let me show you this card. It came out last night. And let me put it in this little thing. It says, what you want, wants you. And see, so it has like a little shell. It has a shell right here and a shell right here. So what you want, wants you. Okay. That part of manifesting what your, your true desires, your heart desires, what you want, wants you to. Okay. There's too much of a glare here. Okay, there we go. All right. Another card, card or two that came out is heaven sent and focus on the light. Beautiful energies here. Heaven sent. Okay. Sorry about that. Trying to get the right lighting, it's gonna glare. We'll just do our best. Heaven sent and focus on the light. You are heaven sent. Also, I feel like we're receiving more light codes, okay, from our sun, our central sun. And all of this, this crown chakra activity, okay, I feel um, like, it, for example, if you have ascension symptoms like ear ringing, Hearing frequencies, lots of third eye pressure. Okay, that's just one. That's just what I'm picking up on. Um, and also, your ancestors, spirit guides are assisting you. Have been sent. Okay, and focus on that light. Focus on that light. What you want wants you. Remember, ascension spiraling up. Okay, and then we have mirror and unicorn. So much of a divine counterpart energy because we have truth revealed and then unicorn represents innocence trust and honesty now a while back i did a reading and it was the message of yes we're unicorns i even made a little design and everything instead of using the word twin flame i even say we're unicorns because unicorns represent this and this magical energy and i view the divine counterparts as this magical energy so what I love about these two cards is it talks about honesty and truth revealed. And so you see the truth in the mirror through your divine counterpart and you guys mirror each other. Both are this unicorn energy, okay? Innocence, trust, honesty, and truth revealed. There's a lot of crystalline white energy as well with all of this focusing on the light. And we also have this card popping out, I'll grab it, which is Moonstone, Mother Goddess. What's cool is we have the Mother Goddess and we have Divine Masculine, the Masculine Energy here as well, with Balance, Patience, Divine Masculine, and Mother Goddess. So we have the Divine Masculine, the, the Father, the Father Energy, and then we have the Mother Energy, Mother, Mother Goddess. And Patience is key here, so we have Patience. Okay, so that's just a little side message. Let's see what else. Okay. Just feeling into what messages want to come out and what deck I want to use. How about some Lemurian? Okay. Crown chakra. Boop. It just confirmed what I was talking about, right? That crown chakra activity going on. Heaven sent right here. And this says the unlimited self. So if you're connecting to your, connect to your unlimited self. Beautiful. Be mindful of what messages are coming through. Allow it, it to unfold. This one is sticking to my fingers. Wow, throat chakra. 
crone, 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 crone. I said crone, crone. Okay. Oh, that's right. We have the eclipse tomorrow. It's a full moon, lunar eclipse. There's so much going on. Uh, anyways, okay. Back to what I was saying. We've got throat chakra now. Okay, so speaking your truth, express your truth, connecting to your unlimited self. It's like, let it fly. Let your wings, let your wings out. Okay, just let it fly. Uh, speaking your truth, a lot about the throat chakra. We are in that energy lately of the throat chakra. Okay. The butterfly, it's transformative when you express your truth as well. And let's get a message for that. What about speaking your truth? Wow, it gives you emotional freedom. Look at this. Wow. Vulnerability, flowing and rebalancing with the throat chakra. So yes, when you exp express your truth, you let your wings, like, let your wings out, okay? And fly, like, express your truth, emotional freedom, being vulnerable, okay? A lot, a lot of what the mind does and the ego, oh, we don't want to be too vulnerable, well, the higher self, heaven sent, is guiding us towards this emotional freedom here. Connecting with the unlimited self. Vulnerability flowing and rebalancing. It's going to rebalance things when you express your truth. Heaven sent from your higher self. Just think of all the light codes. Just go to that place within yourself. You know what? I think I'll just leave the message at that. These short messages are nice to have. Mirror. Look at that. Unicorn. Trust that you will see the truth in all things. Connect to that innocence, that playful part of you, okay? That unicorn energy. Yes, we are unicorns. All right. So I think that's it. Let me get DNA upgrades. Yep. Well, this makes sense. Huh. DNA upgrades. Especially with that crown chakra coming through. Oh yeah, feeling this. I'm feeling this too. More empath and sensitive came up. So empath sensitives. All right, you're gonna get be getting these upgrades. Especially when we have the, the throat chakra with the crown chakra. So it's connecting your throat, your your truth to your higher self in the higher realms so pay attention to that and what can help what assists you being an empath and sensitive let's see these two cards are popping out kundalini rising mm -hmm. that's part of the journey it's the kundalini rising and depending on where it's at or when it's like really rising it can rise say in your throat chakra and and it there's a lot going on with the throat chakra and you're wanting to speak your truth, okay? So it depends on where your kundalini is at at this point. Uh, soul fragments, soul aspects, okay? Claiming those back to ourselves, okay? As we upgrade our DNA, this emotional freedom, trust, pray for the truth in all things, what you want wants you, focus on the light, on, on the beautiful things in nature, okay? And that's the quick message for today. All right. Thank you. Bye.